So I think there are many good tips and many important things to remember when we speak about being a minister of the Word of God, a uh, minister of Scripture. And um, when I think about it, I think about it through really a Trinitarian lens. I think about the importance of keeping in mind the work of the Father, Son, and Spirit in our ministry of Scripture. So first, uh, when we think about Scripture, we need to remember that we are speak when we speak about the Word of God, we are speaking about God's revelation of Himself. So that uh, it is good and right to say uh, when we're teaching, Scripture says, uh, that's fine. But we should always remember that when we say that, what we are saying even more fundamentally is God is saying this. God has revealed himself uh, in these ways, that God has, um, that, that God has uh, given his revelation of himself and spoken to us. And that that is intended for a response from us. So I think that's first. The second thing, uh, as we're talking about uh, being a minister of scripture, in a Trinitarian framework is to recognize that as we speak about the Scripture as that which we are ministering in this day because this is what God has given us as, uh, as the revelation of Himself, that at the same time we also have the living Word of God at the right hand of the Father who is also ministering to us and that, uh, that we circle ourselves around and center ourselves around and focus ourselves, give ourselves to the ministry of Scripture because the living Word of God is working uh, to draw people unto Himself through just the written Scripture. The, 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 the Apostle Paul talks about the fact that Jesus, the living Word at the right hand of the Father, is the cornerstone but that the writings of the apostles and prophets, the apostles and prophets, are the foundation upon which the church is built. And then third, when we speak about our ministry of scripture, we need to rec recognize that the, that the Word and the Spirit are always the two agents of God uh, in working with creation. Irenaeus in the second century said that the Word and the Spirit were the two hands of God by which he created and now sustains the world. So that as we are ministering scripture, the written word of God, we need to recognize that the spirit of God is also active in our ministry. And that uh, it's very important for those who minister the, the scripture and uh, in preaching or teaching uh, to recognize that there are going to be times in which the spirit will do something through your teaching or preaching that you're not expecting and in ways that you're not even anticipating. Uh, and so that's very important and it's very freeing for a minister of scripture to recognize this. All our call is to do is to be faithful in the ministry of the written word. And we can take comfort in the fact that the spirit is also uh, doing his work in the hearts and minds of those to whom we're teaching.